Jeremy, thank you so much. We are talking about a tradition in the pride of Shady Valley. It is the Cranberry Festival returning to Johnson County this weekend. Yeah, right. A fall in our region here to tell us all about it. Miss Diana Howard, 30 plus years. You've been a part of every one of them, Diana. Tell us about this year's Cranberry Festival. Well, we are uh, again doing our annual festival that will support our Shady Rock School. Uh, we will start out with Friday uh, with our annual bean supper and it starts at five. The, we have the beans and cornbread and slaw and all the goodies that go with it. Um, and then we have a silent auction and a main auction. And Ron Ramsey will be with us this okay. year to do our auctioning. He, he has helped us for many years and we just love Ron. Uh, we have a lot of things that have been given to us and donated to us, you know, to do in the auction. A lot of great things. We've got, a, a, you know, some rare dishes that uh, that are going to be in it this year, as well as, you know, a lot of different B&Bs, restaurants, uh, antiques. There's just a lot of great stuff. We, we really make a significant amount of money on our auction. Uh, the monies go to help uh, fund scholarships for students from Shady Valley, either in college or vocational training. So we're all about educating our kids, yeah. And it's gonna be happening on the school grounds. Yes. What can people expect when they head out there? Well, like I say, on Friday it starts uh, at five and ends at whatever time we can get through the auction. <laughs> uh, and it's usually a packed house, so uh, that's a great thing. Uh, then we also have, on Saturday, we have a parade, a community parade. Uh, and so all the tractors, antique tractors and cars and, and so forth come out. Uh, we will have uh, events for our children, you know, the, uh, uh, the hair, they'll do the uh, weaving of the hair and the face painting and uh, the hot air balloon stuff, you know, uh, bouncy houses and so forth. We have 70 plus vendors on the ground this year. Um, and uh, uh, one of the new things is going to be behind the school in our former library will be where Kenneth Sluter sits up to uh, show all of the Indian relics that he has gathered over many years. Oh, wow. Um, and so we'll be uh, a historian will be out there also with a lot of history things off Shady Valley. So we're, uh, you know, excited about that. Uh, so go behind the building, go behind the school in that um, in that little building back there that used to be the former library. Also, we will have a cranberry cafe. Uh, a lot of people uh, are concerned that they don't get enough cranberry. <laughs> you know, when they come. <laughs> that is my concern. Yes. Yes. Well, we are a small cranberry. Uh, you know, it back in the day there were cranberries that grew evidently quite a, uh, a few in the valley, but now there's just a, a minimal amount. But um, Cranberries do grow wild in Shady Valley, and so that's why we decided to pick the uniqueness of that, uh, you know, to be our theme. Uh, but our main thing is all about educating uh, our students and our, our children there in the valley. So we have different events that we do for the uh, students, for the young people, and for the um, elderly people or the uh, senior citizens, as myself. You know, we have uh, you know different quiltings that take place. We also have. Um, uh, an event uh, that's called the um, uh, where the children come in and buy Christmas gifts for their family oh, wow, that's and good. so we wrap the gifts and everything and they get to take them home as a surprise to their family and uh, and parents and so forth you know we do that in December uh, we also have a, a Christmas home tour that we raise funds also last year was the first year for that we're gonna have to bring you back to talk about we're, all this yeah, stuff because there's so much going on days. there is and then also we have uh, we're going to do this year will be uh, the first year um, of a festival of quilts so we're going to do another festival that'll be in April but the festival this year uh, for now this weekend is the cranberry that festival. is what we are looking That's forward to the most yes, and we have all those details Diana thank you so much the cranberry festival this weekend at Shady Rock School. Friday, there will be that bean supper that's at 5 with that live auction starting at 7. And Saturday, the festival will kick off with the parade starting at 10. Opening ceremony at 11. We will be right back.